Hey all, in this video, we are going to see about point estimation and interval estimation. Firstly, what is an estimation? Estimation is a process in which we obtain the values of unknown population parameter with the help of sample data. In other words, it is a data analysis framework that uses a combination of effect sizes, confidence interval to plan and experiment, analyze data and interpret the results. The estimator is a method, formula or a function that specifically tells how to commute and estimate. In other words, to estimate the value of a population parameter, you can use the information from the sample in form of an estimator. Or in other simple words, estimation refers to a process by which one makes inference about a population based on the information obtained from the sample. For example, let's say you want to know the average height of a children in a certain school with a population of 1000. You take a sample of 30 children, measure them and find that the mean height is 56 inches. This is your estimator. Using descriptive and inferential statistics, you can make two types of estimates about the population. Population estimates and the interval estimates. A population estimate is a single value estimate of a parameter. For instance, a sample mean is a point estimate of a population mean. An interval estimate gives you a range of values where the parameter is expected to lie. A confidence interval is the most common type of interval estimate. Both types of estimates are important for gathering a clear idea of where a parameter is likely to lie. Let's see an example for interval estimates. From the estimation example, you might add on a confidence interval of a couple of inches either way. Say it can be 54 to 58 inches then it is called as interval estimate because it has a confidence interval whereas if your estimate is a single value like 56 inches then it is called as point estimate hope you got a clear idea thanks for watching